Good morning, everyone. It is 7.15 a.m. I'm in a strange car, and that's because I'm in a rental car. Uh, so right now, me and the family, aka my dad and cousin, we're on a road trip. So this is our, uh, I haven't named our rental car yet, but we have a Toyota RAV4, and right now we're making sandwiches. We have all of our stuff packed here. We're currently just, you know, at a rest stop in the middle of Nevada. We got the chefs back here assembling our breakfast sandwiches at 7 a.m. We have a cooler full of food. No, do you go see ya? Delicious. And then I'm gonna take this next leg. My dad's been driving for three, about three hours, so I'm gonna take this next one. And I'm gonna keep uh, vlogging as much as I can as we take you on this family road trip. All right, everyone, our first stop on our road trip is Shoshone. I'm gonna well, butcher the name, but I'll insert it here. But um, it's crazy because on all the photos and videos, there's a lot more water, but here you can see there's like barely trickles there and there. The water level you can see is a lot lower but still a gorgeous formation. And just, the, you can see the river in the back over there. And then it flows down this way, down the canyon. All right, everyone, we finally made it to our first hotel. Oh my gosh, it was 14 hour drive today, so it was very, very long, but we're here in Hermiston at the Holiday Inn. And this is what the hotel room looks like. We have the bathroom in here. Small tub. What's up? <laughs> and then we have a full-length mirror. I literally in pajamas because literally just drove all day. Cute little like stand here. Um, coffee maker, small microwave, and mini fridge. We have the two double beds here. And then I love this is super cool. Like this whole like dresser unit. So you have like um, your closet, like hangers. TV, desk, and yeah. All right, as my family finishes unloading the car, uh, I want to take a minute to thank the sponsor of today's vlog, bookingcredits.com. So they are the only website that I know of and they know of that offers cash back on hotel bookings. So it's not, you know, points, it's not a coupon code for like future um, hotel stay, it's cash back. It does come a month-ish, uh, month to month after, depending on, you know, where you book and, and when your trip is, but it's up to 40% cash back, which is kind of insane uh, so for example for this trip all my uh, Oregon stops uh, I booked through bookingcredits.com and I looked on this Holiday Inn's website I have the price I'll you know insert here as well as the booking credits price it's basically the same really but you get cash back with booking credit and how they're able to do that is they buy hotels at the wholesale rate and then just mark it up less than you know the, the big guys you know hotels.com Expedia etc and then they pass the savings on to us with some cash back. But thank you so much to them for sponsoring this video. I really appreciate it. And you know, they're they're helping sponsor all the organ vlogs. So if you're enjoying the organ vlogs, definitely check them out in the links down below and thumbs up this video. But all right, we're gonna get settled and then we'll probably just chill for tonight. Again, it's been a long, long day of driving and then we'll resume the adventures tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. It's day two of our Oregon trip and oh my gosh, I realized that this is gonna be not a lot. I mean, it's gonna be interesting, but like I'm driving most of the time, so I can't vlog and drive. I mean, I can, but I'll have uh, my cousin Cindy take some pics. But right now we're at uh, White River Falls uh, in the parking lot. We're gonna do the little hike to get to the waterfall. So let's go. All right, and here it is. This is White uh, River Falls. It is gorgeous. It goes all the way down the canyon. That's currently a hiking down. Can't wait to show y'all the view. A little weenie self hiking very slowly. But like, there they are. The two massive waterfalls. Wow. Up. We finished climbing and everything, but oh my gosh, the Tillamook factory parking lot is packed and so is the line. Oh my gosh, it's so long. There's so many people here. The license plates of like all the cars here are from all over. 
So you know this is like a big tourist attraction, which I mean, hello, I'm here. Like I'm totally here for the cheese and ice cream. So we're gonna go through the museum as well as check out their cafe, which is, the line is really long, but it's, it's lunchtime. It's 12.30, so that makes sense. All right, here's inside. So here you have the store, which I will stop by and check out. There's exclusive items you can only get here. Then you have the factory viewing and the museum. So let's start here. I guess we'll start with the tour, our self-guided tour. You can see the uh, the timeline of Tillamook. Here's the factory floor. So we have oh the different timeline of everything. So here you have when the milk. Oh my gosh. To the vats, to how they're cooked and everything, to them being shaped all along the factory floors. All right, so we made it through most of the first side. You can see here, the vacuum sealer has the big blocks right there. And the rest of them packing and going, oh, the line just stopped. I love how Ro and I started recording. Oh my gosh, it's all being measured, quality controlled. And then it goes in here into the wrapper. You can see it's getting packaged up. The automatic slicer going at it. <laughs> I feel so cheddar enlightened right now, and now it's time to head to the store and see what we can find in here that's special to this location only. So, okay, we got merch. Oh my gosh, there's like soap and candles and stuff. So cute, and then, of course, the food in the back, which I will be looking at. We have super cute cheese boards, all the water bottle shot glasses, cookbooks, and then more cookbooks. I just want to look at look these cheese. Oh my gosh. Portland dog biscuits. I'm going to have to get something for peaches. Oh my gosh. I mean, definitely need to buy something. I just don't know what. Oh, and they have local Oregon treats and stuff. Definitely will be looking around. How heavy are those? Five pounds? Did I wish I could get one of these five pound blocks of cheese? Oh my gosh. $30. I would be living. And they have so many different types here. Woo. Okay, we have different types of film. You have, these ones have years on them. Why, I'm not too sure. White cheddars, and then these are ones I've never heard of before. So there's like English style sweet cheddar, aged cheddar. I'm not sure if there's a garlic one, I'm definitely gonna try, but yeah, these ones I've never ever seen before. So definitely feel like I gotta pick up some of these. All right, here's the food. We got Tillamook mac and cheese. Wow. They're famous cheese curds. And french fries and a salad. Pretty simple. Alright, let's try a bite of this Tillamook mac and cheese. So they're using penne pasta, which I think is interesting. You see here, they're using penne. Alright, let's see how famous this is. Oh! Alright, that's pretty good. Super creamy, a little soft, but really flavorful. And now they're famous cheese curds. Fried cheese, basically. And there's a spicy chili ranch and a extra sharp cheddar ranch. <laughs> Ooh, the chili ranch for sure. Oh, that's good. All right, everyone, we made it to the Devil's Punch Bowl. A gorgeous view. And then when the tide is super low, that actually goes all the way down. You can go down there and explore, but of course we're here at high tide, so not the case for us, but a gorgeous view and then you have the ocean in the background. Of course, lots of people viewing.
I'm bundled up because we're at the beach. We're at Cannon Beach and it's freezing. Um, it's probably only like 50 degrees, which is freezing. Okay, we're coming down these stairs. I can't wait to, get, to show you guys the famous Haystack Rock. All right, all right these are so steep, but <laughs> there it is. It's a super foggy day, but you have the iconic rocks. The big one being Haystack Rock. Wish it was a sunny day, but we'll take what we can get.